bag. I'm just going to show how to do a little Eskrima training on the heavy bag, how I do it with some knife and some sticks and, uh, and uh, you can use it or you can toss it aside if you have a better way. Uh, I, I don't care. This is just, just how I do it. And uh, I think it's fun and helps with building your fighting skills. So one thing I'll do is I'll stay outside of the bag a little bit, right? Maybe be moving around or just be in a spaced position and throw, throw a combination, get out. Okay, I'll move around the bag a bit. I won't just stay in one position. Move, semi-circle it and try to hit hard and try to hit fast. And when I film myself, I look for my tells. Do I lift my elbow a little bit? Do I breathe in before I attack? Right? I try to make sure that I'm just hitting without too much tell. Right? I'll very level and I'll use different kinds of striking. I'll come from the closed position. I'll come from open. I'll fake so that it looks like I'm coming this way and around. Another thing I might do is work on uh, close range striking just by being close to the back. Coming here and my work on my short power. Right? Here. Touching. Maybe touching here. 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 Okay. Close range stuff, right? Maybe works a little snap cuts or abanicos. Just working a little bit of speed, stick speed. Okay, maybe I'll come in here. Right, thrust. Right, thrust. Thrust and slash, right? Maybe slash, thrust, slash. Different combos. Thrust, slash. Right, notice my live hand comes on. My checking hand. Okay, I might be kicking in here. Get that checking hand out there. Okay. You can just try power striking. Just work on your power. Okay. Okay. Move around. Get in and out. Right. Get out. Work on a root block. Work on a wing block. Okay. Inside deflection, outside deflection, maybe play some double sticks. Right? Uh, a little more combative. Moving around your bag. Different combinations. Abanico, Abanico. Get used to this drill. There's no power there, but it's switch hitting side to side. Which going to this side? Maybe I open somebody up for a power strike, right? But developing. This speed in this way also works my forearm strength, which helps my power in punching. Okay, I was good with my left. Can also work on flowing around, moving around the bag one direction to the other while doing my strike combination. So one of the things I might do is if I was 
play it, play it using this bag is I might come in, slash, move around, right? Right? Just kind of snap out here, do that there. Just practice getting in quick and scoring, okay? Right? Get in quick. Push off, move, right? Use your knife at distance. I keep the point on my target, right? Moving around. Getting it in and out. Quick jabs. This is a much better bag for, for knife training. You want this to be able to swing. So here I've got a moving target that I can play with. And just slash, right? Baby thrust. But it gives me something to play with that moves and is small enough that it can be a bit of a challenge. Now you wanna, you might want this, this is up at head level, but you might want to put something lower so I can practice cutting the lid, right? But I'm practicing cutting a moving target. So this really helps my coordination. And every once in a while I'll hit with my arm just to get it swinging more or slow it down. Okay, get it swinging. Okay, move around a little bit. And just cut. Okay, and again, I can play with double knives. But just a little bit of coordination. And a lot of fun. So another thing I might want to do is just train a little flow. Double just for the fun. This is, is not necessarily a but it's good for coordination. It's just a lot of fun to do.